Hey, welcome back to the uh, latest episode of uh, This Guy's Thoughts. A, uh, tonight's episode features a brew out of uh, Terrapin Beer Company out of Athens, Georgia. This here is their uh, Hopsecutioner IPA. And this here is coming in at 7.3% uh, alcohol by volume. And it is a 71 IBU. And on the back of it, it says uh, six varieties of hops. Uh, let's see here. Centennial, Warrior, Chinook, Simcoe, Amarillo, Cascade. And it uh, says right around the top there. Uh, artwork on this. You got like a little uh, executioner there. I'm not sure if that's like a supposed to be like a turtle or some type of a hoppy type of monster but you got the guillotine there um, it's actually got uh, some pretty cool um, artwork there so he's uh, executing uh, the hops by uh, cutting them uh, dropping the guillotine on them so uh, definitely a pretty unique um, artwork on there it says a uh, killer IPA so um, artwork on this fantastic artwork um, they really uh, did a fantastic job on this uh, we're gonna go ahead and crack this thing open and uh, get a drink on this mm, smells pretty good coming out of the can Let's see what we got in here All right, we're looking at a uh, darker amber color. Uh, looks somewhat uh, clear. Um, I can see silhouette on there. It's not um, so murky that I can't see through it, but I can't really make out images on the other side. Uh, good amount of carbonation inside the uh, glass there. As you can see, it's a nice ambery color. Uh, aroma wise citrusy citrusy pill um, slight maltiness but not a whole lot of what I'm picking up about a finger and a half maybe uh, not quite two fingers of a head up on top of this just an off-white uh, head color anyhow definitely smells uh, got the citrusy hoppy um, but it's a, more of a citrus pill type of aroma coming off of this. But we're going to go ahead and get a drink on this. Okay. I can taste the citrus, the pill, the citrusy pill um, flavor coming out of it. A little bit more malty than I thought it was going to be. But pretty good. Um, pretty good. Aftertaste wears off pretty quick. Uh, medium body mouthfeel. Definitely very solid. Going right to the scoring here. Uh, zero, I don't want to see this crap again. Six, I pushed an old person down to get the last one. You know what? Uh, Four. I'll drink it anytime it's available. I'm going to go with about a 3.8 out of 6. I do recommend you going out trying this if you haven't had it yet. If you have, drop a comment. Let me know what you think. Uh, but I'm going to go with 3.8 out of 6. Uh, be sure to check it out. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That's my thoughts.